And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. It's Real Madrid taking on Liverpool. Well, what a night, Derek. Two great teams, a perfect pitch, a magnificent stadium and millions watching around the world. What more could you ask for, apart from maybe different commentators? begins in goal. Ferland Mendy plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Luka Modric plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And the main goal scoring threat provided today by Karim Benzema. So the starting lineup for Liverpool. Alisson begins in goal. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Joel Matip in central defence. Mohamed Salah plays with Sadio Mane out wide. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And now the Champions League final commences. They could run onto it here. Eder Militao. Really inventive stuff from Real here. And let's give credit to the defending. Karim Benzema, who's played at such a high level in an attacking sense for so long. Stuart, what do you anticipate seeing from him here? Yeah, he's a real handful, particularly when he's running with the ball. And of course, his finishing has been so clinical. That's why he's their leading goal scorer. He's in behind. Can he convert? Fine goalkeeping to push that away. Well, so close to getting that early goal there but it was a wonderful save by the keeper you have to say Liverpool corner given But he's gone short with it. And it's Salah with the cross. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Henderson. Shot up and blocked for now. Alaba not given a moment's peace. Modric. Here's Carvajal. Tony Kroos. And the cross is very much on. Great strong tackle. Throw in forthcoming.
David Alaba. Modric. Benzema! Oh, he's missed, but by a minuscule margin. Well, he couldn't have made better contact than that. His technique is brilliant. He's so unlucky there. Well, great read there to intercept. Matip. It'll go harmlessly through to the goalkeeper. Virgil van Dijk. Casemiro. Able to skip past his man, making sure it didn't get past him. He's driven in the corner. Not did his job defensively. Eder Militao. Tony Kroos. Now Casemiro. Excellent passing. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Quite the tantalising free kick he was hoping for. Goalkeeper's ball. Liverpool have given it away. Well, Real have had so much of the ball in the last 15 minutes. You sense it's inevitable the goal will come. It'd be certainly no less than they deserve. They just need to be a bit more clinical in that final third now. The referee might well have been tempted to book him for that. Resisted the temptation. The ball with Luka Modric. Luka Modric with the pass. And he finds the net. He could hardly miss. Well, here's the replay, and it's a simple finish in the end. But where was the defending? That's just not good enough. And Liverpool get the ball moving again, looking to find a reply to that setback. Effective challenge. Diogo Jota. Mane. Henderson. Firing is in. It's still alive. And I think the threat has been averted. Well, still behind here, but only due to some incredible goalkeeping. Surely it's only a matter of time if they keep piling on the pressure like this. Immaculately placed by Casemiro. And a goal to increase the lead in this final. Will they be stopped now? Well, 
as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And the finish showed great composure. Just to lift it over the goalkeeper. That's a lovely goal. Second goal for them here. Just not looking confident in possession. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. Matip. It's with Fabinho. Thiago. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. Touched onto the woodwork. Well, no danger now. Real in a good position out wide. Can he take the chance? Benzema. And turned onto the woodwork. And that is that for the first half here in the French capital. Into the second half then, in this battle for Champions League glory. He's found a pocket of space. Mane! Superb save. Well, he should score, of course, but that's a brilliant save. Taken short. The delivery from Salah here. Well, the goalkeeper doing what he's paid to do. Well, behind for another corner. Favouring the short one. A delivery from Salah here. And a no-nonsense clearance. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. And intercepted it. And it's a quality pass. Challenge carried with it quite the element of risk. Now, what's the referee going to do next? Well, when you endanger the safety of your opponent with a challenge, you're going to be sent off. It's that simple. Yeah, what was he thinking? That's a definite red card. The referee had no option. target Stewart well it's a decent effort but I don't think it was ever going to trouble the goalkeeper
Virgil van Dijk. Here is Thiago. Well, no luck keeping possession. Well, Real Madrid have certainly dominated the ball, as you can see. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Thiago. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. Is it going to be? And the flag has been raised here. Well, there can't have been a lot in that. And great use of the ball to keep possession. How can he take them on and beat them? Valverde. Will it be? Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Salah. Can they hit on the break? Defenders need to cover. Well, an example of a counter-attack that went nowhere. And still an opportunity. Under real pressure here. Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? Well, it is a yellow card and the referee having a word. Well, if they're not careful, they're going to lose a couple more players here. They've completely lost their discipline. They're out of control at the moment. Casemiro Mendy and room now out on the wing he's in with a chance can he convert well no examination at all for the goalkeeper and on that basis he's going to be a bit cross with himself Fabinho Van Dijk with it really good high press well he's thwarted him almost effortlessly counter attacking very much an option and so it will be a corner They take it short. <laughs> David Alaba. Given away by Real Madrid. He's in behind. And a goalkeeper on top of his game. Well, it's great goalkeeping. What a big save that is. Keen to take it short here. And it's Salah with the cross. And he did what he had to do defensively. And possession given away. Vinicius Junior. Well, technically offside, but not by a lot.
Carvajal and cuts inside chances on terrific save well that's a top class save he read it so well Let's see about the delivery. Well, threat over for now. Vinicius Junior. Camavinga. And now Rodrigo. A real defensive commitment there. And it comes down to the final five minutes. Milner. Robertson. And players waiting at the far post. Well, if truth be told, he made it rather straightforward for the keeper. Well, he knows it. That is a real waste of a great opportunity. Thiago and return to Salah well timed tackle he'll be delighted to have won the ball having made that difficult challenge the tackle completely mistimed and you would expect a booking under the circumstances but it is a caution and stay calm might be the instructions that should come from the manager yeah you're absolutely right if they're not careful they're going to lose another player fairly soon and showing fine vision Vinicius Junior can they convert a really sound goalkeeping well that's such a good save isn't it how did he keep that one out And the short option preferred. Benzema waiting. And clears the danger. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. And there it is! Real Madrid, Champions League winners! Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Real Madrid. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it.
A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.